Welcome back to ITW Extra, powered by JSA. We are here live at ITW 2023, and this is the official broadcast of ITW. And joining me today is Bruce Garrison. He is the CEO of Bandwidth IG. Bruce, welcome. Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, looking forward to our uh, brief discussion. Yeah, I mean, the floor is still buzzing here at ITW, even though it's the final day. Uh, coffee lines are still long. We see suitcases going by. People are uh, getting ready to leave, but it's been an amazing, amazing three days here at ITW. Uh, so let's talk a little bit about Bandwidth IG. And for those that are unfamiliar with Bandwidth IG, why don't you give us a little more insight about the company? Yep, sure will. Um, Bandwidth IG, and it's Bandwidth IG is for infrastructure group. Uh, we build and operate purpose-built infrastructure to the most connected internet destinations mm -hmm. in our markets. Uh, and what I mean by purpose-built, um, a lot of the legacy networks, uh, fiber networks were built 15, 20 years ago. They've been acquired by a couple of different companies. Uh, there's less fiber availability. So Bandwidth IG saw an opportunity uh, with the explosion of uh, internet traffic, right. cloud. Now there's uh, machine learning and AI uh, that these platforms uh, were going to run into challenges without uh, much more dense fiber. So uh, purpose built to us means 100% uh, underground, same fiber type, uh, very high duct packages. Uh, and a long runway, and it's just a its a critical asset that's now, uh, it's turning into a utility. Uh, well, thanks for giving us uh, that information. And you've had a number of announcements over this past year, including one big one uh, with your appointment of the CEO of this company. So why don't you give us a little bit more information about your role and some of the additional leadership team members that you have added? Yeah, sure. Um, yeah, I was fortunate enough to get the opportunity uh, to join Bandwidth IG in December of last year. Mm -hmm. So I'm making around the six-month mark. Um, uh, the business is around three years old, a little, little over three years old. So the founding team outside of the CEO who uh helped start the business and stand up but um wanted to step away um majority of the founding teams there uh our 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 next few years is really about commercial execution so i had added a chief revenue officer uh a gentleman named Patton lockridge who joined us uh, about six weeks ago um, and to kind of yeah, <laughs> welcome Pat. Congrats! And, uh, and to round out the team, and uh, for the foreseeable future, uh, I think we have a good group intact uh, to cope uh, execute on our mission. So, in addition to you know the announcement of your appointment as the CEO, and we have a new CRO, uh, there's been other exciting news coming out of Bandwidth IG, including some expansions in the San Francisco Bay Area. Yep. So why don't you chat a little bit about that to our viewers? Yeah, I will. And, um, it's a great question. Uh, yeah, so we have we recent uh, announcements that happened in the, the Bay, so the San Francisco Bay Area. We also operate in the Hillsboro and or uh, Portland area and Atlanta, uh, but specific to the San Francisco Bay. So uh, San Jose is... Uh, if not the most, one of the most connected internet traffic locations on the West Coast. Uh, Silicon Valley in the Bay Area continues to be a hub for data center activity. Uh, so going back to that purpose-built statement that I had said, we built three, now have three new routes. Again, all underground, all uh, multiple duct packages, so a long runway of fiber unique to all of those legacy networks. Um, so we are super excited about that, uh, you know, really giving network optionality uh, in the Bay Area. Uh, again, to, uh, you know, all up the Bay down through Santa Clara down to San Jose. Uh, and we actually have more exciting news uh, to talk about uh, towards the end of the year. Uh, something super unique also in the Bay Area, but We'll hold that for a little bit longer. Oh, yes. We'll definitely hold that for a little <laughs> bit longer. And uh, 
Maybe we'll be talking about that at some of the fall events uh, yeah, I hope so. that are coming up. Uh, is there anything else you wanted to add? Uh, and as far as from an expansion perspective, uh, yeah, we're doing more in uh, Hillsborough area. Okay. Uh, again, another data center market. Uh, so we'll continue to invest uh, and add more route miles in Oregon. And we're also um, probably most excited about Atlanta's uh, seeing a lot of activity, again, on the data center, uh, progressive efforts on power and availability there. So uh, we will continue to invest a lot in Atlanta. And our uh, our network in Atlanta, we expect to almost triple. Uh, so that's another time where we're spending uh, a lot of capital, but also a lot of time and resources uh, to serve our existing customers and future ones. Well, exciting news coming yep. up uh, for Bandwidth IG. And is there anything else you wanted to add today? Nope. Yeah. Just appreciate the opportunity. Excited. Uh, it is a super unique business. Uh, you mentioned the point about all the buzz. You know, it's a lot of the telecom world. Right. We're doing something. Uh, it's really mission critical infrastructure that's making AI and cloud possible. And uh, it's a niche business uh, with a lot of our customers here. So it's been a great event. And uh, thanks for uh, it, let me join your uh, interviews. Yes, thanks for thanks for joining us. It's been a pleasure having you yep. here on ITW Extra, powered by JSA, live from ITW. Where can viewers go if they want to learn more? Uh, the website bandwidthig.com is a, a good place. Uh, LinkedIn uh, is another one, uh, and then uh, on our website we have an event section. So the teams are going out to. The other industry events uh, you can connect with connect with us there as well all right great bandwithig.com bruce thank you again for joining us and thank you viewers for tuning in to another episode of itw extra powered by jsa live from itw 2023 happy networking <laughs>